Hey everybody, Seven here. Uh, we're going to do another Moodle moment. We're going to take a look at a way in which you can take content from one course and copy it over to another. Now in the past, we've looked at how you can go and take a full course and copy it over. But what if I don't want to take a full course? What if I just want one item in there, a lesson or a quiz or something like that? Do I have to copy it over and then delete everything out? No, you don't have to. We've got a feature on our system that lets you take over individual items. The feature is called the sharing cart, and I want to walk you through how to access that. So to access it, I'm right now we're looking at uh, within the eCurriculum catalog on our K-12 Boodle server. We've got a course here. If I click to preview that course, it'll come up. Okay, and so here is a class that's got different items within it. I'm going to go into uh, Fiction, and I'm going to look through here. And let's say this assignment, that's all I want is this assignment that says technical analysis. How do I go and grab that? Well, to do that, the first thing I need to do is I have to have teacher access to this. If you don't have teacher access within the, within the Moodle system, on our system you have to request it. Um, that gives you access to all the e-curriculum catalog. If you are attempting to get access to resources that someone else has in one of their classes, uh, they have to grant you teacher access for this to work. The reason why is because once you have teacher access, you click here to turn your editing on. Now that the editing has been turned on, you'll see over here a block that says sharing cart. I'm going to show you what it looks like if you don't have that in a little bit. But this is where you can go and add in individual items from a course. So I'm going to go down to the assignment that says technical analysis. I'm used to clicking here where it says edit and going and grabbing different things here such as editing the settings and such but there's actually another button over to the right. It looks like kind of three um, silver lines stacked on each other. If I hover over it it says copy to sharing. If I click on that a little pop-up will come up. Do you want to copy that? I'm going to of course click OK. When I do that if I scroll back up I can see now it has been added to the bottom of my sharing cart. And this works so you can go into any course of the curriculum catalog and literally take an item here, an item there, and build up your cart. Now I'm going to go into my class. Uh, I'm just starting working on my class here and putting some things in. So once again, I need to click Turn the Editing on. And when I do, my uh, blocks have shown up. But you note, I don't have the sharing cart block that appears here. And this is going to be typical in your own class. Um, it's something that you have to, to actually add or turn on, which you can do. So I clicked the button to turn my editing on. And down in the lower corner, where it says add a block, I'm going to add in my sharing cart. Now, that will appear over here. In this case, you see that technical analysis has been added. If I click on that same button, we had before the one with the three silver lines. This time it says to copy back to the course. If I click on there, my course now says, well, where do you want to put it? It gives me these little rectangles. I can go ahead and put it whichever place I would like to. Once you put it in, you can drag it around and move it just like you would any other Moodle file. So that's the way you go and add things with the sharing card. It's really slick um, and, again, allows you to pull over one or two things from a course, from many courses and do so pretty quick. The keys are you have to have teacher access in both the course you're taking the content from and the course you're putting it in. Uh, if you don't, you'll need to request that um, from me or from our uh, AAPD online support. So once again, another Moodle moment and happy Moodling.